Hello, hello, this is Budgets with Grace, where I give you a glimpse of my life through the lens of my budget. My name's Grace. If you don't recognize the software you're seeing right now, it's called YNAB or You Need a Budget. You should definitely give it a shot with the link below in my description. It will give you a free month plus it will give me a free month on top of your free trial. So it's just a really good deal for both of us. And it's some of the best budgeting software out there. In addition to that, if you see some features in my account that you don't recognize in your own, it's probably part of Toolkit for YNAB, which is a free Google Chrome and Firefox browser extension. And you can also find a link for that in my description. Who wants to hear life updates? <laughs> Life updates. Basically, the main update is Amazon is very demanding. I've only been there two weeks, and the first week was great. I super love the culture, and everyone is super welcoming, and just feel very much a part of the team. And uh, then the second week happened, and my brain became a very full sponge, and I just kept trying to get more information to absorb, and uh, it was... It, it's been stressful, but today's the last day of the week. It's Friday. I get to film a budget video and uh, I'm ready for some rest. Ready for some chill video editing this weekend. Okay, what am I even looking at? I wanted to show what my income is going to look like from Amazon. So, uh, I was paid $15.35, which I believe is how much I'll be making when I work full time. And then I just took out um, the cost of my um, electronic equipment, basically just a wireless keyboard and a mouse, um, and put that directly into the category because it's a reimbursement. Um, I'm not even sure that this is included in this total. Um, I thought I would be making a little bit more than $13.52, but um, I'm doing it this way for now. And then if this does come back in a separate check or something else, I will just budget into my inflow and call it good. But I don't like that there was so much overspending on my budget. Not a fan. So actually this cleared too. I took out some cash, which has cleared. And the biggie, my windfall, has cleared. Now getting into the fun part. Ooh. Okay. Got it. All right. So first of all, I want to talk about my windfall. I added a little bit of money here, so it would be an even 2000 which means I have 3000 remaining to save. Um, I don't want to create a goal for that because I just want to put my extra money towards it and see how far I can get. And found it, I what I did go through and find a little bit, so I'll address that at the end. And for Weekly Budget Wednesday, I um, put in this reimbursement that I got from some coding text editor that I'm not really using anymore, so they were really nice and gave me a refund on my annual. So that's cool. believe we are all good in February. I just am remembering that I want to begin fully funding the school instead of funding just what I need every week. I want that bar to update. And, oh, I also didn't fund future. What am I even doing, guys? And let's see. Probably gonna wanna top this off. Just call that good for now. Now I want to try to fund what I have at the beginning of the month. So I just click on underfunded and then Forest helps me with the mortgage. So then I just divide by two. Same thing with the electric. And 2314, 40. Oh, how, how nice that I have just enough to do that one. Oh, and almost just enough to do the cat litter. That's cool. I'm a fan. All 
All right, so those are pretty much all the things that are due on the first. Um, just the HOA fee uh, would be the next kind of highest priority for me to fund. And da, da, da. where am I going to throw this last amount? I think I will release this found it. Oh, I'm going to release it in February. So it looks more like how I wanted it to look. And then I think I will just put all this into food spending. Cool. And I think that I'm pretty good in terms of like what I can sweep into found it, but I will do a quick check. I think I could take at least 535 from um, Dates with Forest. We have done so much better at not eating out. I'm super proud of Forrest because we love, he specifically, we also, but <laughs> we love eating out. And I just haven't been seeing friends. I think actually, oh, my friend paid for me. We went for beers, so <laughs> she was nice and bought me a beer. And coffee, I also just haven't been doing a lot of. I'm going to stretch and try to do 592. Well, maybe 392. Coffees can be silly expensive. Personal spending. I'll take a penny out of here. Why not? Every little bit counts. Cool. And now, again, I'll release this and see what I can fund into next fun month. Maybe I'll... I know that I want to get myself a pair of me undies. So I'm just going to flip back. Oh, it's not going to be in that category. It's going to be in personal spending under clothes, me undie. Oh, I must have gotten us two pairs in December. Fifteen twenty-two. <clears throat> the goal is higher because I usually just get forest a pair, and um, it's slightly more expensive for dudes boxers. Oh god, I already forgot. Was that right? I was right. Alright. Car spending, cat spending. Hmm, maybe instead of doing the coffee, um, I'm going to subtract, let's see, it'll be 104, and I have 20 bucks, and, oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do it from that category, I want to do it in March. And then I will put 20 into my windfall category. Oh my gosh. There we go. Awesome. Every little bit counts. Um, I am going to create a goal on this because I want to see a fun bar. But I don't want to do by date or anything. I'll just do target. Because I don't, yeah, hopefully I can do it very quickly once I get a little bit more ahead into March. Right now it is March 12th. Yeah, tomorrow's the 13th and then Sunday is the 14th Valentine's Day. 
Ooh, I just remembered something. A lot of you were asking to see the shawl that I knit, and I actually knitted two scarves. Um, one of them I gave away to my uh, not-in-law mother. <laughs> Can't really call her my in-law yet, but she probably will be. So I gave it to her for her birthday, but I also did this one, which I just had this kind of hideous neon pink yarn in my yarn collection. Um, but I think it's kind of, it kind of turned out pretty. I used the yarn on the border. Oh man, it's already snagged. Damn cats. From the yarn that I bought for the other shawl. So this is the color of the whole other shawl, but I thought this turned out kind of pretty. I think I'm going to donate it to maybe a shelter nearby and maybe hopefully some little girl in need will really enjoy and love this or some little boy. I don't, somebody might just, this might speak to them. But yeah, I've been a knitting fiend lately. I have basically got to get going for work, but I just want to say that I'm really happy with where my budget is right now. I'm really excited to be spending from this new job income, and I just think that um, good things are to come. So stick around, subscribe, comment, like, all the things, and I'll catch you next time. Bye! Bye!